Welcome to JTech and Grow. In this lab, we are to manage user accounts in Active Directory. You can go ahead and check out other test out videos on this channel and many other useful videos. And if you're new to this channel, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and like the video. Thank you. In this lab, your task is to use the following information to make necessary user account changes on COP DC. You can go ahead and read all the other instructions. So straight away we go to a Hyper-V machine, COP server, COP DC, double click, go to tools, active directory users and computers, expand the copnet local let's enlarge that and let's follow the steps mary burns from the accounting department has forgotten her password and now has account now her account is locked unlock the account reset the password so they have given the password the new password then require a password change at the next logon so accounting department mary bands right click and go to properties account click on unlock you can either come through this way then later on we can go to reset the password unlock and click ok or directly from here you can go to reset password then you can put the new password So this is the shortest way, shortest possible means. You just right click and go to reset password. Then this is already highlighted and you can click on unlock the user account and click OK. So we are done with that. Next, Mark Woods has been fired from the accounting department. Disable this account. You go to Mark Woods and right click and go to disable account that's pretty fast the next part Benton is returning to the research dev develop department from maternity leave her account is disabled to prevent logon enable her account so research dev the name is part Benton right click and enable account that's also simple the next is Andrea Simons from the research dev department has recently married rename the account Andrea right click and go to rename you can actually go to properties to do this also but it's faster when you do it from here so the, the new name will be Andrea Soko you click enter it will take you to where you have to now you see everything has been automatically filled when you type out the name you click the en enter and you can see even the logon name has already uh, excuse so from here we have to edit the logon name and the last name last name will be Soko okay and the logon name will be Asoko. Ah, 
a circle and okay it's automatically changed here so i think that should be it for this one you just make sure you confirm everything and the last part of this says for all users in the support ou but not the support managers ou allow logon only to the support computer so i think this is where it gets a little tricky from the support ou we go to the support ou so you can easily identify users from the type from the type colon you can see here user you can see a user so you click user i will just do all, all, both of them at once control you hold your control key and select the next user right click on one of them and go to properties go to accounts from accounts you go to computer restrictions computer restrictions log on to the following computers so here all you have to do is to type support please don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you're new to this channel thank you we add and click ok and i think that should be good I guess we are done with this lab let's check it out completed you can score the lab see you in the next video